Yep. Back out. What a day. Happy New Year. Happy New Year, guys. And all that bollocks. Alright. Right. So, today we're in the Newlands Valley. This is the Newlands Valley. It's looking typical Lake District weather. It's supposed to be alright, isn't it? But look at it. A little bit rainy. But that's not. Uh, back out with Rob. Skinny Rob. First camp of the year. First camp of the year. That's your second, first really. Camp of the decade, actually. That's your first wild camp. Out last night with Wayne, wasn't he? Well, I suppose I. In a hot tent. <laughs> Living the life fandango. In a hot tent with Wayne. <laughs> <laughs> so we're gonna, um, we're just gonna walk along this valley. And then there's a steep bit at the end. And we'll come out at the town, hopefully. Unless we get lost. The weather's not great, like, but what can you do? It's meant to dry off later, as long as it's dry. It's raining at the minute, like, but if it dries off, it'll be ice, so, just so you can stand outside, talking rubbish. Uh, I hope not. Right. Crack on, because it's getting wet. So we'll come up through this valley. There's a fork in the road, left or straight on. We took the left, which brings you up, up here. And up to the up to that waterfall, just above the waterfall, that's where we're headed. Plenty of water source anyway. Ominous. Gives me carry too. Two years. Two of water. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that one. It's been bad. It's been raining a lot here. I think this is Heinzgoth. This one, this big one here. Uh, I think it Could be. Dale head over there. I think this one here is called Great Gable, not the Great Gable. Just another one. Ah, uh, it is high scar for that. Is that Great Gable, that one there? It's just straight in front. You see it? Gable Bay Crags somewhere there, I think. Oh, uh, the Crags. It's like, uh, I can see, look at that path going at the side of that. Ah, yeah, I thought I saw that. Is that, is that Mm. Possibly. Oh, it is, I think. Oh, it is. But it's brooding here, like this weather. It's that, it's that like misty rain, isn't it? It just uh, drenches you, like. Yeah, well, be right. The type of rain that gets you wet. It is. <laughs> <laughs> Not like that dry rain. <laughs> Some walk up. It's a long trek through that valley. Come all the way from the end of there. Up the up the side here. Nearly there though. Windy. Always bloody. It's gotta be windy later. Dale head up there. Top of there. Oh. Oh. Oh, we're just nearly, uh, we're just walking along casually. A gust of wind caught him, nearly took him over the edge. <laughs> so you've got to be careful of the gusts. Because they can have you off balance and you're gone, like. Right. That's the way in. That's the way out tomorrow, around the corner there. Valley. I think we're about 100, 100 feet or so off the top. Uh, we're going to town. We'll see. So, after that epic slog, oh, aye. that's behind the wall as well. Isn't it? If, I think the walk is only like two and a half miles. I'll find out tomorrow. I'll record the track going back. That's Dalehead Town. To a water source up there, that'll be Dale Head. This is the, the pitch and put area. Should be a little. I should have brought some balls up. Uh, balls. Cricket stumps and that. I'm hoping it would be sheltered here, but the wind's coming from that way. It's coming straight in. 
Not really. It's sheltered enough. Oh, look at this. This bit here. This is a better spot here. It's fucking. It's like, like a pine green, isn't it? <laughs> it's like your front garden. <laughs> Actually, just in the house. <laughs> the house is just behind us, out of shot. <laughs> Imagine I'm in the garden like this. Anyway, we're gonna get set up because uh, it's dark now. Skin. Twenty past four. I think we set off at half two. Not far, but it was like a bit of a trek on it. Uh, we're both about. Uh, we're both about. Uh, we're carrying a little bit of holiday weight. <laughs> <laughs> so this is Dale Head Town. Anyway, we'll get set up and see what, see what we'll come back with. Third camp in a row, setting up in the dark. So we're all set up. I'm just having a, uh, a cup of bottle. A little bit bothering me. Eh? All set up here. Stop lifting the weight. Bought a new pillow from Go Outdoors. Aeros something. But I had one of these before, green one, and it popped inside, so I never replaced it. It was really comfortable inside there. But this time, I'm going to keep the receipt in case, because they are comfortable, but if it goes, the company that I got it from, they didn't want to know. I tried to return it, they didn't want to know. I mean, Rob's got the big red, big green bags. He's just here. We're trying to shelter from the wind, so we've got the tents turned out the wind. Mine's on a right angle, you can see that. We've had to pull it that way. These guy lanes are here. It's, it's alright as long as it's up, it's solid enough. I'm right, just gonna get this down anyway. And then we'll get out and have a beer. Got steak for later on. I think. Get everything sorted. Sorted. And the time. It's only 25 past bloody five. No way. <laughs> <I> <laughs> feels like it's about 10 o'clock. <laughs> it's about five. Oh man, these bloody long nights. That's what I say, that's why I'm not having my booze yet. Oh no. Nah. Huh? Wait at least six o'clock to start that. <laughs> Nonsense. Right, this should be ready. So, we stood out in January, in the middle of nowhere, in the pitch black, drinking beer, talking rubbish, and it's raining. Kinda. Just make rub out there. A green frog Whew. with <coughs> look at this. Neymar killed this. Fucking heat warmers in there and all. Neymar called this. Shut up. I might zip mine up actually. Oh, the bloody rain. It's that rain that gets you wet. It just gets you wet. It's horrendous. It just needs to stop. The winds change direction, which doesn't help. I'm gonna have. Uh... Oh, it's hard to function with gloves on. <laughs> right, I'll keep that dry. Anyway. At least, me, at least my bag will be dry. How many? How many have you done, then? Two cans. You've got how many? Are you three left? Three cans. Can have lots of big things. Got um. It's life and death. My, that's just not bad. One. What's that? In? Oh, Northern Monk. Northern Monk, one. It's just right up here. Because Rehills, Rehills is shut. It's closed until this Monday. New World. It's alright, that's. I mean, that's six and a half percent. So it's not like weak beer. Anyway, I'm going to have a bit more chat and then get in and do a tea. Hope this rain there. Uh, no, oh, I wish it would stop, eh? I'm just getting drenched, like. Right, the camera's getting wet. Nah. Oh. 
Ridiculous, this amount of condensation is just horrendous. Everything's ridiculous, you can't open the vents because the rain's coming in. And because the rain's coming in, you get loads of condensation. Oh. the next day. It's not gone well. It's kind of really sick. Got that one. Ugh. What a day. What a show. What we're gonna do is, I was just having a cup of coffee, I can't face it. And then we're gonna get packed in a way. We've just gotta go for it. Get waterproofed up. And then pack all this stuff in the tent. And then just, it's just a case of dropping the tent outside. It's gonna be soaking, we put it away. But, you know, it dries off. What a night. It was forecast to be dry and wind free, light breeze. And it's just completely upset. <laughs> Not to worry. Uh, still be bad. Oh, face. Oh. It's my face down like there. Disaster. I've got a down jacket here. It's absolutely soaked. I put it in the porch. Look at that. This is what the problem is. The bloody puddles forming out there. Great big puddles and they're coming in. I'm absolutely swimming. Everything's drenched. Down jacket, down bricks. The floor is all soaked. <coughs> I was just saying there, it's going to be the packs are going to be heavier going back down because there's 40 gallons of water absorbed into them. Oh, what a disaster! What a nightmare! As long as this is dry, like it's a sort of dry that will dry out. I'll just put them in the tumble dryer when I get home, but oh, it's just a nightmare. And that ruined will dry out all right. Tumble dryer with a few tennis balls to buff them up a bit. Ah oh, well, my hat's drenched as well, I can't even wear my hat. <laughs> what a disaster. I'm supposed to know what we're doing. <laughs> oh well. Right. Oh. Slow pack and then we're going to get off before anything else happens. <laughs> tarn. Dale head tarn. Let's go for a little swimmer. Nope. And here's the little pictures. Pulled it all over that way because I can't get my guy lanes out that way. 
Yeah. Can you see it? I can't. Eh? Yeah. Good lad. <coughs> Good lad. <coughs> Good lad. <coughs> Good lad. Good lad. Good lad. Good lad. Good lad. Good lad. Good I knew it tucked it away, so I thought, well, it, it'll be by the wall, like, so it might be all right. Absolute carnage out here, like. <laughs> <laughs> the bottle left my bottles there and all. <laughs> bottles and <laughs> cans of in pools of water. Look at the pools of water we're in. This is the problem. This is what's gotten in my tent. It's got underneath the, the side there. Hasn't got in the inner, though. That bathtub's good. It's waterproof, nice and dry. I've got my stuff away anyway, I'll just get the tumble dry, I'll be alright, dries out. So I'm going to just put this camera down now and uh, nearly ready to go. Oof. Dale head turn. Your rain started again. We pitched it just down there. Circular. So we're going back. Out this way, on the back of there, down, down that path, like the path at the bottom there, and then down into the valley, into that valley, about two miles, two and a half miles, something like that. I'm going to try and track the route on the way back, see if that comes out. It's windy, rainy, not forecast to be windy and rainy like that. It was absolutely mad, damn gusts. It was 40, 50 miles an hour gusts there, which is coming from nowhere. But uh, we survived. Not the greatest camp, but good laugh, you know. It's always better when there's a good company. With Dale head up there. Right, I'll put this away. If there's anything interesting happens, we'll let you know. Descending. We've come across this, look at that. And there's a plunge pool at the bottom, you could get in there. Be exciting. It's amazing. There's Rob for scale. down off the top and we're just making our way down we're coming down a different path we're coming to a lower path today we went a high path yesterday this is nice here make a nice little day walk how, how do you feel that camp went well a bit wet a bit windy we made it packs twice as heavy i do on swimming pool <laughs> indoor in your case <laughs> <laughs> My own, my own personal water supply, <laughs> plumbed in. Indoor swimming pool. <laughs> <laughs> I was plumbed in. So anyway, we're heading down into the valley, and then uh, back to the cars, and then we're going to go and get something to eat. And then home, work tomorrow. Boo! I mean, I've been at work all week, so it doesn't really matter. Right, off.